smarty goof. Golly, inventing stuff sure is fun. You said it, Goofy. Oh! oh get the hose! Wow! Oh. That got it. So what are you boys making? We built a best buddy invention for the Hot Dog Hills Invention Competition. Yeah, we made it together. It's Mick and Goof-tastic. Presenting... The Morning Getter Upper Car! That's cool. The Getter Upper is the ultimate time-saving driving device. Show them, Goofy. Yup. <laughs> While automatically taking you where you need to go, the Getter Upper gives you a shower. <laughs> and it even makes pancakes with syrup. Gorge. <laughs> Too much syrup. Oh, I need to fix that. It's amazing. How did you dream it up? It, it was, was teamwork. teamwork. Hello there. Say, fellas, get you all done with my smarty wrench? I'm gonna need it for the invention making in my laboratory. Here it is, Professor Von Drake. I'll bring it right down. Golly, what you making? Wrench, please. My masterpiece for the invention competition. The Smarty Hat! Whosoever puts this on their little noggin is gonna become right away super smart! Gorge! Can I give it a try? A goofy man is the perfect test subject for putting on my Smarty Hat. What was that squishy sound we're getting? Syrup? <laughs> yep. Whoa! Wow! <laughs> hmm. I am experiencing an unusual sensation in my head. Here I got it, one doozy woozy of a mathematical equation. Let's see if you can figure it out. The answer to this simple equation is this, and a peanut. I found the peanut on the floor. That is correct, and I give an extra bonus points for the peanut, too. <laughs> Goofy, how would you like to help me demonstrate my smarty hat at the big convention today? I would find that agreeable. Hey, Goofy, we need to get going. A timely observation, Nikki. Uh, Goofy, you sound a little different. And what's on your head? The smarty hat. It's the professor's invention. I was helping him test it. Mr. Smarty Goof, the Smarty Hat stays here. Agreed. It seems to be stuck. Oh, it must be the result of the adhesive properties of the syrup. Oh, I'm gonna need to rip up a formula to make it unstuck then. And I see you over at the invention competition. Allow me. Huh? It. The Getter Upper is ready to roll. The name's rather silly, <laughs> don't you think? Silly? <laughs> I think it's making Goof-tastic. But the vehicle needs a better name. The Automatic Daily Conveyance. Well, I like what we already have. It's the Getter Upper. Check it out. It needs one final touch. Now the engine is more efficient. That means it works better. But... Don't worry. I'll make the rest of the improvements at the competition. Improvements? What improvements? Greetings, all you brainiacs from us autophiliacs. This is Billy Beagle reporting live from the Hot Dog Hills Invention Competition. Mayor McBeagle... Clara Clock and I will be judging who will be the winner of the Super Inventors Trophy. I rerouted the flam jammer and plugged up the gummy converter. But it was fine before. I have to disagree. These liquid flow ropes are not secure, and the syrup tanks are. <laughs> oh, inadequate. Oh no! We gotta stop the leak. I am working on it. Ooh, 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 Mr. Smarty Goof, 
I got some sticky syrup on sticking spray. Oh, 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 oh. Gorge. I feel like my old self again. Oh, oh, do me! The, the, the leak! Leak? Oh, I know how to plug it up. Bubble gum. Great thinking, Goofy. Next up, to present his invention, Professor Ludwig von Drake! Come, come now. Time to get this smarty party started already. You hear that, Mickey? I'm gonna get smartied up again. Ah, uh, being smart is okay, Goof. Just stay a little goofy, Goofy. Hello there, judges. Allow me to inter-demonstrate. The Von Drake Smarty Hat. Whoever wears this becomes an instant genius right away. Now, Goofy, I want you to now invent something fabulous using only the items on that table. Hmm. Put this here, and this here, and golly, I made an automatic scratchy arm. What? And now, with the smarty hat on. <laughs> and what do you call those things? Extending grab hands. Observe. Wow, I love Apple. That smarty goof was really something. <laughs> Say, Professor, uh, uh, could I, uh, maybe borrow the smarty hat? Why, certainly. I just think being a little smarter might help me and Mickey with our invention today. Hi, Goofy. You don't need to wear that hat now, do ya? My increased intellect should help us win the competition. And now, Donald Duck and his automatic fishing belt! Next up, the happy helpers with their groundbreaking bold copters. Thank you. All right, girls, in three, two, one. Oh, 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 beautiful oh, oh. takeoff. Oh, 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 and that's a wrap for the happy helpers. Next, it's Mickey and Goofy with their morning getter upper car. Correction, it's called the automatic daily conveyance. Uh, Pal, I still think our other version was just fine. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, this is much improved. The automatic daily conveyance is the ultimate time-saving driving device. It will drive you wherever you need to go. Whoa! Uh, this is going a little fast. And while on the road, you can get your exercise. <laughs> you can also enjoy a nutritious kale, kelp, and carp smoothie. Whoa, whoa. Oh, that was kind of fishy. Cool. Oh, Mickey, are you all right? I'm okay, but that crazy daily conveyance is all messed up. But I made lots of improvements. Yes, uh, but it's not ours anymore. We built the Getter Upper together. This thing just isn't the same. And neither are you since you put on the Smarty Hat. So you don't want me to be super brainy smart? Ah, oh, pal. You're smarter whether you wear the hat or not. You've always been a goof. A smarty goof. Gorge. How about we show everyone our big finish? Hold on to your Bunsen burners, folks. It looks like Mickey and Goofy are about to show us what this baby can really do! If you're in a rush and you don't have time for breakfast, just press the Whirly Twirly Pancakey Maker. Let's fire it up! <laughs> I hope they're hungry! Wow! This is amazing, folks! They're flying and making... Whoa! Uh, Blueberry! My favorite! Ladies and gentlemen, 
gentlemen, this is the most fun invention I've ever seen! I love it! We love it! And it's delicious! <laughs> Mickey and Goofy win! You did it! it! And I present to you the Super Inventors Trophy! You know, in reflection, those yummy pancakes could have used some syrup. <laughs> Syrup for everyone! <laughs> <laughs> Adventures in bunny sitting. Oh, man, that's all the stuff from the attic and closets. Boy, this junk really piles up. Hey, wait a minute. You can't give all our stuff away. We need these things. When was the last time any of us needed clown shoes? It's always good to have a spare set. All right, the clown shoes stay. And what about this old unicycle? You mean Bobo? No, no, Bobo, no, Gogo. She's losing it. Now, Daisy, it's all going to charity. It's a good cause. Don't listen to him, Bobo. You're more than an old unicycle. Happy helpers are here for you. Minnie speaking. Hi, Clara. The Hot Dog Hills Play Center is closed today. <laughs> and you need us to babysit your twins? Oh. oh, why, certainly. Just bring your little chickadees by. <laughs> Come on, Daisy, to the turnstile. <laughs> oh, my, that was fast, Clara. <laughs> we didn't even change our clothes. <laughs> oh, hello, Cleo. Hello, Clifford. Don't worry, Clara. We'll take good care of your little darlings. So, if the play center is closed, then who's going to watch all those other kids? Happy helpers! This is a babysitting emergency. There's no one to watch El Ray or Pearl and Buck. Doodles, that's a lot of kids. Is that a unicycle? Maybe if we ignore them, they'll go away. Oh, don't be silly. Of course we'll watch your children. <laughs> oh, thank you! <laughs> hey, Al Ray, bet you can't catch us! <laughs> Goodbye, Pearl! Goodbye, Pop! Have you got room for one more? <laughs> oh, why, of course! I'm Mr. McBilly, and this is my son, Buddy. Hello, buddy. Mm. He's a little shy. I'm a bit nervous to leave him. Oh, don't worry, Mr. McBilly. We'll take good care of buddy and help him make lots of friends. Hear that, sport? Now I'm off to the store to find some shoes. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come out and meet everyone. I'll show you the turnstiler. It's really fun. <laughs> <laughs> Your Royal Highness. Everyone, this is Buddy. He's new in town. Hi, Hi buddy. buddy. Buddy, this is Elway, Huck, Pearl, Clifford, and Cleo. And this is Daisy and Kukuloka. Now, why don't you take a run through the turnstiler? Yeah, it's really fun! <laughs> oh, so that's where my chicken costume is. Isn't that a little small for you? I was young once. <laughs> Oh, dear. We're not off to a very good start helping him make friends. Oh, he'll make friends. And they're such good kids, too. Listen how quiet they are. They... Hey, where'd they go? Oh, the birdies flew to Coop. Wow. <laughs> oh, no. They're in the apartment. Oh, my. The children shouldn't be in there. <laughs> Come on, buddy. We have to go get your friends. I can't leave you here all by yourself. Oh, hi. I'm here for a pickup. Oh, yes. The charity items. <laughs> hey, where's Buddy? <laughs> oh, Miss 
goes. Bobo? No, no, Bobo, no, go, go. Buddy? Buddy! Come back! Now, kids, this is our apartment. It's where we live. And it's not for playing. Oh, well, can we go back to the play center? We were supposed to have a party today. A party? Hey! Buddy ran off, and now he's hiding. Oh, dear. You have to bring him back right away. Don't worry. I'm not letting him get away. Bye! While we're waiting for Daisy and Buddy to return... Uh, Buddy's right here. Buddy! Thank goodness! I'll call Daisy and let her know he snuck back. Buddy, don't be scared. We're all friends here. Now, Buddy, that's not what a chicken sounds like. A chicken is more like cluck, cluck. A happy helper's always prepared for a party. Well, the kids are having fun, even Buddy. <laughs> well, sorta. Aw, poor kid. He's right back to hiding. But hiding is his favorite thing. <sighs> Maybe that's how we'll help him. Hey, kids, let's play hide and seek. <laughs> <laughs> I love that game! Now, everyone hide, and I'll count to ten. One, two... Excuse me, I, I don't know where to hide. <gasps> I bet Buddy could help. Oh, Buddy! Could you help El Ray find a good hiding spot? Um, sure, follow me. Thanks, Buddy. Come on, over here. One, two... Hold on, Buddy! Bad, Bad doodles! Oopsie doodle! Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> oh, I think I found someone. <gasps> it's Pearl. <laughs> hey, Minnie. <laughs> found Clifford. <laughs> found Cleo. <laughs> and Puck. <laughs> now, where are El Ray and Buddy? They sure do have good hiding spots. <laughs> Aw, oh, there you are. And since I found you last, you two win. We won! Awesome! Yeah! Thanks for finding us a great hiding spot, buddy. No problem. Hey, want to play ping pong? Oh, yeah, I love ping pong. I want to play, too. <laughs> How am I ever going to get him down from there? Wonderful. Buddy's finally making friends. <laughs> awesome, Buddy! Thanks! Yeah, way to go! Pearl, Buddy's not on our team. We lost. Again. Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, it wasn't easy. <laughs> I got Buddy. Buddy? <laughs> Buddy's been here the whole time. He's here? Who's in the chicken suit? Uh. 
Way to go, Daisy. You caught a squirrel in a chicken suit. Hello? Is anyone here? It's my dad! It's parrot pickup time already. Dad! Look at all the new friends I made! All right! <laughs> well, how wonderful. Thank you, happy helpers. <laughs> it was our pleasure. Mom, can I have a play date with Buddy? Sure you can. Dad, you never got any shoes. I couldn't find any long enough. Wait here. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Hold your foot up, please. What do you think? Clown shoes? I love it. Awesome! Told you they'd come in handy. <laughs>